2020 presidential candidate Elizabeth Warren swiped at former Vice President Joe Biden Sunday, saying, it's not enough to be, not Trump. Warren spoke at a campaign event at International Fountain Park in Seattle to the largest crowd of her campaign thus far, according to Bloomberg. The event drew an estimated 15,000 people. We're not gonna win this by just saying, not Trump, Warren told crowd Sunday. It's not enough to be, not Trump. I know how to fight and I know how to win. Detroit, Michigan, July 24, Democratic presidential candidate U.S. Senator Elizabeth Warren, DMA, participates in a presidential candidates forum at the NAACP 110th National Convention on July 24, 2019 in Detroit, Michigan. The theme of this year's convention is, when we fight, we win. Photo by Bill Pugliano, Getty Images, Warren's comments come as Jill Biden assured voters on August. 19 that their other candidates might be better on issues than Biden. Voters must focus on beating Trump by choosing Biden. Related, Joe Biden's campaign strategy has focused on attacking Trump for association with Obama. Your candidate might be better on, I don't know, healthcare, than Joe is, but you've got to look at who's going to win this election. Biden's wife said Monday. And maybe you have to swallow a little bit and say, OK, I personally like Sir and so better, but your bottom line has to be that. We have to beat Trump. 2020 presidential candidate Cory Booker similarly critiqued the former vice president Wednesday, emphasizing that Americans should not choose a safe candidate. We need a candidate that is not the safe bet, Booker said Wednesday. We need a candidate that can speak not just to the head, but to the heart and to the gut. Polls show that Biden has the best chance of beating Trump in the 2020 presidential election, and that the former vice president is the current front-runner out of the Democratic candidates. A CNN poll released Tuesday reveals that 29% of Democratic and Democratic-leaning voters say they would vote for Biden, up seven points from June the CNN survey conducted after the first round of Democratic debates. Related, Biden campaign ad bashes Trump, calls him in, erratic, vicious, bullying president, an August Quinnipiac University poll also revealed 49% of voters believe the former vice president has the best chance of beating President Donald Trump in the 2020 presidential election. 50% of voters said they believe electability is more important in a candidate than compatibility with your views on issues. Content created by the Daily Caller News Foundation is available without charge to any eligible news publisher that can provide a large audience. For licensing opportunities of our original content, please contact licensing at dailycallernewsfoundation.org. Let's block ads. Why?